The Tesla Cybertruck 2021, which is now pushed back to the year 2022, has more updated features than mentioned before. Wanna know it all? Then watch till the end. Hey folks, welcome back. In this video, we'll be talking all about everything you'll need to know about the Tesla Cybertruck. But before we start the video, make sure to like the video, subscribe, and comment on your favorite type of vehicle in the comment section. Done? Let's get started. Tesla has now announced that the Cybertruck electric pickup truck will be postponed until 2022, after months of hints that it might be delayed. When Tesla first introduced the Cybertruck in 2019, the electric pickup truck was expected to hit the market by the end of 2021. With the deadline approaching, there have been indicators that the Cybertruck could be delayed during the previous year. To begin with, Tesla just finished the engineering design for the electric pickup truck. Elon Musk, Tesla's CEO, has warned that getting the Cybertruck to market will be difficult due to features such as the steel exoskeleton body, which will necessitate whole new manufacturing procedures. Despite these worries and the fact that the end of 2021 deadline is approaching, Tesla has been coy about acknowledging that Cybertruck manufacturing has been delayed. Tesla kept the same timeline when it released its Q2 2021 financial results last month, stating only that Cybertruck production would begin at Gigafactory Texas after Model Y. We are also making progress on the industrialization of Cybertruck, which is currently planned for Austin production following Model Y. The fact that Model Y manufacturing is expected to begin at Gigafactory Texas by the end of the year doesn't rule out the chance of Cybertruck production beginning this year, but it does make the timing implausible. Tesla, on the other hand, revealed a few weeks later that the Cybertruck will be postponed until 2022. Tesla amended the footnotes on the order page to confirm that the configurator will be accessible when production nears in 2022. This is despite Tesla previously stating that the two higher-end Cybertruck models, dual motor and tri-motor, would be released first. The note is the identical for all three variants. Tesla's website makes no additional mention of a Cybertruck timeframe. A contest is presently underway in the United States to bring the first electric pickup to market. Tesla was never expected to be the first to market, and this delay isn't going to help matters. It's not, however, the only one encountering delays. Rivian recently announced that their R1T electric pickup truck would be delayed from July to September. Lordstown is likewise having trouble getting its electric pickup off the ground. The Hummer EV is slated to arrive in the United States by the end of the year, while Ford will launch the F-150 Lightning the next year. While the Cybertruck's delay was expected, many people will be disappointed because Tesla has apparently received over 1 million bookings for the vehicle. Tesla's all-electric pickup truck is much stranger in reality than we could have imagined. Many in the audience laughed as the truck rolled onto a stage at Tesla's design headquarters in Hawthorne, California. This isn't a joke. The stainless steel, A-frame body of the Cybertruck is so unusual that it's easy to ignore the truck's more important elements. The Tesla Cybertruck is expected to hit the market in 2021 with a range of up to 500 miles, a maximum towing capacity of 14,000 pounds, and a starting price of under $40,000. The Cybertruck might be a hit if Elon and his team can deliver on their promises. A Tesla Cybertruck with a single motor and rear-wheel drive starts at $39,900, not including destination charges. The entry-level dual-motor all-wheel drive Cybertruck costs $49,900, while the top-of-the-line tri-motor all-wheel drive Cybertruck costs $69,900. Teslas are no longer eligible for federal tax incentives, unlike many other electric vehicles. For $10,000, you can upgrade to full self-driving. The first deliveries were supposed to start in late 2021. We'll make a few deliveries of the Cybertruck in 2021, Elon Musk announced in January 2021 but volume manufacturing is slated for the following year. You'll be able to finalize your configuration when production nears in 2022, the Tesla website claims as of August 9, 2021. As a result, it appears that the vehicle will be delayed once more. For a $100 refundable deposit, the Tesla Cybertruck is currently available for pre-order on Tesla's website. The Tesla Cybertruck's towing capacity in the tri-motor all-wheel drive form 
is £14,000. The single motor and dual motor models tow £7,500 and £10,000 respectively. All Cybertruck variants have a payload capacity of £3,500. The most expensive tri-motor Cybertruck has a claimed electric range of 500 kilometers. The dual motor Cybertruck has a range of 300 miles, whereas the standard single motor Cybertruck has a range of 250 miles. According to Tesla, the fastest tri-motor Cybertruck can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds and reach a top speed of 130 miles per hour. The dual motor Cybertruck takes 4.5 seconds to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour, whereas the single motor Cybertruck takes 6.5 seconds. The body of the Tesla Cybertruck is cold rolled stainless steel, similar to that of a refrigerator or the DeLorean from the Back to the Future movies. We noticed during the Cybertruck's debut event that the steel bodywork needed to be cleaned frequently to remove fingerprints. We also saw Tesla's design chief, Franz von Holzhausen, slam a sledgehammer into the driver's door panel with no obvious damage. Tesla showed photographs of a stainless steel body panel that had been shot by a 9mm bullet at a distance of 10 meters at the Cybertruck unveiling, albeit the claim was not totally substantiated. The Cybertruck's hardened stainless steel bodywork appeared unharmed, save from black smudges at the impact location. The transparent metal glass of the Cybertruck, on the other hand, fared significantly worse. Tesla's chief of design, Franz von Haushausen, demonstrated the company's strength by hurling a hefty metal ball at the driver's window, breaking it. If the failure was a fluke, Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, suggested Franz try the back window. It too was quickly shattered. While some sections of the Cybertruck may be impenetrable, the windows are not. The Tesla Cybertruck has a seating capacity of six people. A three-seat backbench is available, while the front section incorporates a foldable middle seat that may be used as a center console when lowered. The bed of the Cybertruck is referred to as a vault by Tesla. The bed is 6.5 feet long. The Cybertruck has 100 cubic feet of lockable storage space between the bed, the front trunk, and storage compartments built into the bed's upper panels. Tesla's enormous supercharger network, which now has over 14,000 chargers, can be used by the Cybertruck. The Cybertruck can charge at a rate of 250 kilowatts when using the latest V3 version of Tesla's charger. The Cybertruck, according to Elon Musk on July 15, 2021, will not have door handles. Instead, the automobile will recognize and open the door for the owner. The electric pickup market should be crowded by the time the Tesla Cybertruck is available for purchase, with entries from Ford, General Motors, Bollinger, Rivian, and others. Adaptive air suspension is one of the Cybertruck's standout features. The Cybertruck can not only rise and decrease its height as needed, but can also lower its back to allow for easy loading of motorcycles and ATVs through an inbuilt ramp. For an additional $7,000, purchasers may add self-driving technologies, including automatic parking, trailer docking, and Tesla's full self-driving capabilities. We should point out, however, that no vehicle currently on the market is capable of totally autonomous driving. The inside of the Cybertruck, like the rest of Tesla's fleet, is dominated by a huge, centrally positioned touchscreen that controls most vehicle functions. The Cybertruck's sliding cargo cover restricts the driver's view backward when it's lowered. As a result, Tesla incorporated a digital rear view mirror that shows the view from the vehicle's rear-facing camera. For whatever reason, the steering wheel is not spherical, but rather shaped like an aeroplane yoke with a left and right grip. On November 21, 2019, the Cybertruck was unveiled at the Tesla Design Studio in Los Angeles. Tesla claimed the Cybertruck's armor glass windows were practically impenetrable during the introduction, but two of them were smashed when Franz von Haushausen held a metal ball at them. The ball didn't make it through, Musk joked, adding, but we'll correct it in post. He then explained that the windows were broken because the door was pounded with a sledgehammer during a previous demonstration, cracking the base of the glass. Microscopic cracks created in both windows during previous ball-throwing tests before the unveiling explained why the back windows smashed as well. 
The Tesla Cybercorp, an all-terrain vehicle, was built onto the bed of the Cybertruck using built-in ramps in the tailgate at the conclusion of the demonstration. To charge the Cybercorp's batteries, the Cybercorp was hooked into the Cybertruck's onboard power source. The ATV will be sold separately from the Cybertruck as an optional bundle. With that, we've come to the end of the video. Let us know your thoughts on the Tesla Cybertruck in the comments section below. See you again with another exciting video. Until then, bye.